Good. You got it. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. Didn't you sing yesterday? Well. One of the days you did. Um, no. Never. Um, so, we got all the, uh, doggies coming over. You guys see Soy? Yeah, he made it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay. He, he's a different dog when it's getting cool. This is cool. What's the weather? Oh, yeah. It's 60, probably about 63. It's 63, guys. It feels amazing. It does. It actually feels pretty good. It's a little chilly, though, <laughs> on the chilly side. <laughs> I feel great in my shoot dang ranch uh, sweatshirt. Yeah, I feel great in this what people don't like of a shirt. Oh, cut off? It's gonna wear that. Why even wear a shirt? Because it covers the nips, baby. My my baby looks good in a cut off. Because when you have a muscle shirt and you, you have show them muscles. muscles, you wear it. Why else? That's right. Golly. So, I was trying to think of some real smart stuff to say. Like, if there's a car wash, you put your car in it. But then I was like, they're going to take that nasties. Uh-oh. They did now. <laughs> um, so, yesterday. What happened <clears throat> yesterday? We, did get, we got some good work done. Mm -hmm. um, it's crazy to me. That the slightest amount of finishing work really makes it look totally different. Yeah. Doing the eaves and stuff. Uh, it really does, like, put it together. It's very interesting. Yeah. Because, uh, I mean, it's just little pieces here and there, but it does just, like, make it... Any little framework that you can still see on the outside once you start covering it, it's just, like... It's coming look, together. This looks like a freaking house. Yeah. Dang it, we cannot touch the... Uh... Okay, good job. Um, and then, <clears throat> so we were working on the house yesterday. We did have a couple hour delay. Yeah, the neighbor um, came over. Yeah, and uh, did tell us some stuff that we needed to know about electric and just, just stuff out every, here. Yeah, and... everything. <clears throat> so it was good. And it's always good to talk to you all. Yeah. All Randy. All Stubbs. But, um, so we didn't get as much done as we wanted, but you're going to keep working today. I got to yeah. go to work. Myself. Okay, Bandit, you gotta go. You thinky? Yeah, that's bad. Bandit, Bandit go. Woo. What'd you get into? I don't know, but that was, I don't know. <laughs> that, was, uh, that was rough. But, um, after, kind of towards the end of the day, <clears throat> I took Jason out um, to the field where we're going to put our... I took you. That is true. Don't be taking the... You, Baby. Yeah, we uh, stole somebody's four-wheeler. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. And uh, went on to the field <clears throat> where we're going to put the Barn Dominium, and it was just really like, okay. You guys really want to watch that. Um, and, again, this is not just like a plug to go watch the video or yeah. whatever. Uh, you guys know we've been working on the pig area. We took a little break just because – we had other stuff going on or whatever, but uh, to be able to see that from out where the house will be, mm -hmm. and with Jared Mode, uh, with the green grass, the grass, green grass, with the green grass all around, <laughs> the grass all green, um, the knowing <clears throat> like the pond is, our track, everything, like everything that you see. It's just awesome. Yeah. And then the sunset yesterday was killer. I don't know if it comes out as good in the video. No. Um, you said no. I like. I just don't. <laughs> just straight up no. 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 I mean, it's you looks still pretty, see it, yeah. but there's just. I mean, you guys know what it is versus seeing in real life. Yeah, and um, I that it just like really got me when I like turned around. It was like that would be our back view mm -hmm. right there. Um, it, for the barn dominium. Yeah, like it was, it was, yeah. it was a little bit of motivation. I guess. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. It's like a nice little, it was a little motivation, a little reminder too that, yes, tiny house isn't like the end goal for us. We do. It's a somewhat temporary. Yeah. Thing. 
And I mean, and then it would be a great thing for guests and everything like that. Yeah. You guys already know all this, yeah. but um, yeah, just to be out there and like where the yard will be and everything and just looking at it all, it's like, okay. Yeah. Got it. This yeah. Is, this is the end goal. This is. And that was um, one of the first things when we came out here to mm -hmm. look at the property that we saw and we were like, this is where we would put a barn mm -hmm. And so that's roughly it. almost a year later and we're doing stuff and now it's like okay we got a tiny house jared's up there the shop's yeah. here uh racetrack pond like it's all the vision is coming together that's what's so it's yeah. just so i don't know it fills your heart up a little bit yeah. it just feels a lot better maybe you fill my heart up there's no maybe. room to, there's no room in the heart to even fill up more <laughs> with views like that well what are we gonna do about that I'm going to have to just take you out of my heart a little bit and say some room. <laughs> nah. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It was just nice. And cause again, yeah. it was, that's for me what sold this property. Literally, yeah. as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh, yeah, and, this. And then just like you said, visioning it all. Yeah. And then kind of seeing it. It's yeah. happening. And like backstory of, you know, if you guys are somewhat new here, um, it was a bunch of property, different lots or whatever, and it was 30 acre lots, and mm -hmm. we were only coming to look at 30. Well, originally coming to look at 10. Yeah, true. Um, and then uh, we looked at 30, and uh, I was like, yes. Woods, yes. woods, woods, it's all, creek. Yeah, this where it's just like straight wood and it had the shop on if it you saw the shop and you were sold yeah i was like dang that, that like that already it's older mm -hmm. but Again, that's the vision that's a 20 30 thousand yeah. dollar thing right there you know and i was like it is old we could fix it couldn't even you know, get into it it really. would be an instant barn with the water tank yeah. like all this stuff and then she had to cut around and look at the open field and she wanted that. And I was like, again, it's just that view. I thought we were about to break up because we we're going to have to fight over which 30 acres. And, uh. Well, no, you were like. I know. We can, uh, how about both? And I was like, 60 acres is a lot. That's yeah. That's a lot. Like, what? Is that going to be too much? To, like, and I was like, it'll never be too much. Yeah. Um, never be too much. Uh, I was very, I don't know if we ever talked about this, but I was very anxious about. Yeah committing you know to 60 acres and then just all the work that would be done and everything like that and then that's when we invited jared up yeah and said hey hey you can come up here get a little section for you if you help us yeah and so all that transpired um aren't you glad we didn't do 10 acres oh my gosh um and 10 acres would be more than enough yeah don't 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 it think just we're like spoiled a, or anything well with 60 it, acres but, you are kind of well i'm just saying like like if you have 10 acres don't think that like you can't do everything you want to do oh yeah. we were just able to spread out yeah um we we could have done at that point we wouldn't have invited jared up or, probably not 10 that'd acres be too no, a little too close <laughs> um but uh to have the 60 is a dream yeah um I always wanted land. We were lucky enough. Our family has land, uh, you know, ranch and stuff. And it just, it's just always, there's something about being able to just go out and just roam yes. and explore and not have anyone else on top of you. And it's just an awesome feeling. Mm -hmm. I mean, people, I mean, I would travel to do that. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, that's, that was always my dream as well. Yeah. Um, I was just very like anxious about it i guess overwhelming yeah well but, you're also talking just like anything the more you get the more money the more uh, you know responsibilities exactly all that type of stuff and but i just and, again you're always the one that's like this is the dream yeah we're gonna make it work we're gonna go for it yeah it, there'll be like only thing that can really stop us is ourselves pretty much and, and that's it's Jason's motto it's been fun yeah. like i mean clearly we have our hardships and stuff and we're still trying to get like electric it, it's yeah. been a it's been a process but through all of it yesterday being out there just like kind of just like a 
hey, this is coming to life. Like, yeah. this is happening. Um, you know, it, it was a great reminder. And uh, it kind of made all the struggles that we've got. Like, I, it feels like 10 years ago uh -huh. that we had to stay in the shop. It, it a lifetime even, ago. I was about to say, it doesn't even feel like it was this life. No, it feels it's like so a lifetime weird. ago. And it's that so was weird. a struggle. Yeah. Um, Jared living in the tent in the shop. And yeah. then we were trying to be in that room. And, you know, it was just this struggle. And then the animals all right there. Just like everything. Yeah. And, um, now it's like, all right, just go to the shop. Feed the animals. No big deal. You know, That's like, weird. yeah, it's a lifetime ago. So pretty much if you're going through some crap right now and you're like why 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 it's worth it yeah just keep it's pushing so worth it. yeah is and then that's what we're still doing now we're still still yeah. pushing uh there's still so much to do you just there's always going to be a million and two things to do but yeah you won't live your dream if you don't go after it yeah oh thank you, you <laughs> that. over me that's so you're He's breathing excited. hard there he there is he is just don't hit the chair uh oh, uh -oh. Nope. Okay, watch out, Soy. <laughs> Soy, go, 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 keep going. He said he's gonna try to lay down. Go. Yep. He's gonna he, knock the can. Guys, if you saw how we have this camera set up, it's very. It's not that we don't love our dogs. Come over here. Just come over here. And you can lay down right there. Okay. Oh. No, he said I'm gonna turn around. Come here. Okay. Over here. Oh, oh come he up. There I'm so you go. Excited. There you go. They lay keep down going. right there. Keep going. Soy. Yep. <laughs> but so yeah. Um, what is today? Thursday. Thursday. Ooh, okay. Keep going. Come on. You're definitely going to be the one to knock yeah. it over. Um, but yeah, Thursday, uh, again, you have to go to work. Um, so I'm going to just finish. I was really hoping you could have seen it. I know. But, uh, it's kind of a cool thing too that like it gives me motivation whenever she's not here. Um, just to like work, 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 work. Uh, that way when you come out, it's just like, holy cow, look nothing like this. Yeah. Like it was cool to like, you know, put the zip system up and it was cool to put the, the siding up. It was the cool. Roof. The roof, like little things like that. So like when you leave and you come back, just like, like what? Like, yeah, it, that's just a cool feeling. And, uh, Which is nice. Like working at the hospital and then just coming out here, like. So working at the hospital and coming out here, just like knowing everything that we have to do, like, okay, this, this, so it's just stress and stress. Yeah. And then you see, like, oh. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I explained that very well, but. No, they got it. You got it. <laughs> yeah. I work at a hospital, I'm stressed, I come out and, oh. Yeah, see? That's, yeah, that's right, spot on. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, but, uh, yeah, I'm excited for it, and it'll be hopefully not too hot today i don't know what the weather is going to be like but if it's anything like it's been the last few days it'll go a little spicy but I nothing was hot yesterday yeah but nothing maybe you hot every time baby but it wouldn't be, it's not gonna be anything near what it's been no. this summer so um it's still like even the hottest days is still like 10 to 20 degrees yeah cooler than it was yeah so, so, take it yeah I'm <laughs> um a lot of people were asking about the parakeets Oh yeah. Um, uh, are we gonna are we gonna talk about that right now? What? Nah, they're good. Um, but there is a update on them. On like I show them in that last Crocker Life video, but yeah, yeah. they're doing good. Yeah, they uh, uh, uh I I reached my hand in there. One of them's a little more skittish. The first one we caught, mm -hmm. the darker blue. That one's a little more like willing to jump in your on your finger and stuff. The yeah. other one's a little more skittish, but um, I had more time with you. Yeah, but I did get the light blue one, and uh, <coughs> I kind of like in a nice calm way. I grabbed it, <laughs> and I stuck it on my hand. I super glued its feet to my finger so it couldn't go nowhere. No, didn't do that. Some of y'all can take that serious. I know. But uh, yeah, I did get the bird, and I put it on my finger, and then I just like in the cage of course and i just like left it and i didn't try to pet it not just like let it kind of get my scent mm -hmm. all that type of stuff and uh then after a little while like i just got my thumb and i was just like petting it yeah and they're i mean they're cool they're, they I are mean, really cool it, it's rad having two parakeets out here that just like showed up 
What are the odds? Yes. Um, and I like what they're in right now. Yeah, it's freaking cool. I think it's super cool, but yeah, there's not... They do need a little bit more room, so... Jared is going to get a different thing. Yeah, we're going to get a different cage. maybe a bigger version of what they're in now. I feel like it's cool. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I think, that's, I think that's a good talk this morning. It is a good talk. Anything yeah. else you want to say? I got to poop. Oh, is that why you're trying to end it? Yeah, kind of. Oh, okay. <laughs> this coffee be hitting, baby. Yeah, I'm trying not to drink a whole cup because I got to go back home and go to sleep. But I just want yeah. coffee. I just want to drink coffee with the people and my baby because he's looking good in his cutoff. Baby, you looking good covered up in a hoodie. Never thought I would ever hear you say that. <laughs> I was just being silly. <laughs> All right, end it. We know we're going in here. You're going to take that hoodie off. Yeah, because it's going to get spicy in a little bit. Y'all heard it here first, people. <laughs> <laughs>